you? It's Tuesday today, so happy Tuesday! Um, so I just came back from a walk with Cruz. I'm gonna wear the beanie because it's freezing cold outside and I think I need some time until I get warm again. I'm gonna prepare some tea and then let's have this vlog started! stories today and I'm sure you might have seen this this one and I'm so excited about it because last year when I went in Lithuania and Poland um, I had a pair of sorel boots with me and they were the best thing ever because they kept my feet so warm and yeah I'm expecting that the temperatures are gonna be much lower than Poland um, in Norway so yeah thank you so much for sending them so I'm gonna do a bit of fun wrapping here as well so these are the boots they are burgundy and sweat yeah they are I've already worn them and they are extremely comfortable I think you could tell uh, how enthusiastic I was in my Instagram stories because I kept saying the word comfortable so the model is the um, sneak chic alpine and in case you don't know about Sorel and you are new to the brand they are really popular in Canada or Northern America and people are snowboarding wearing these boots so I think these boots are made for walking and also for cold temperatures very high hopes for them so last year when I went to Poland and Lithuania I got these Sorel boots with me and they have been much loved as you can tell I wore them in so many dog walks around Scotland and also when it's snowing and they were brilliant and I loved them so I thought that this year these Sorel might also be a very good addition to my closet and since it's gonna be so cold, you know, I'm gonna need them. I always try to think of my outfits before I go on a trip. I try to think of the weather conditions and the places I'm gonna visit. So if it's gonna be a museum, I have to be a bit more sophisticated. Or if it's going to be, you know, a mountain, I have to get like my track boots with me. I always get just the amount of clothes I need. I like traveling light because, say, if I wanna run between terminals i'd rather have like a handbag with me with the absolutely necessary and save myself the hustle and the stress so yeah these are my outfits i'm gonna tell you one by one what i'm taking and why i'm taking it with me all right guys this is it that's all that i'm gonna get with me top shop jeans and this denim shirt and then on top i'm gonna have this uh, cashmere jumper from Dunedin in edinburgh and possibly I'm gonna pair that with this barber scarf that I got last year. It has two different um, sides, so you can wear it either with the gray one or you can change it and have these gray, black, pink mustard stripes, which I think it just adds up to the outfit. And also I'm gonna wear this barber beanie, which is one of my favorite ones. 
So this will be outfit number one. Outfit number two is gonna be this next dress. It's an old one. I think you might have seen me wearing it in one of my Instagram stories very recently. And then I'm gonna wear this top shop. It's a very, it's a crop top, black crop top underneath. And then I'm gonna pair it potentially with this scarf that I needed last year and it's one of the most warm scarves I've ever worn not because I prepared it myself but it is outfit number three is going to be this pair of white Hollister jeans I'm hoping that the weather would be appropriate for that and then this mango sweater I'm gonna wear my grey beret that I got last year from Paris and it's one of my favorite ones in case I need a more thick scarf I'm gonna get this one from with me which I got last year from Zara and again I wore it on my trip to Poland and Lithuania it kept me really warm because it's really thick it's actually like a blanket it's very wide and I'm hoping that if I need to go outside and it's really cold I can just layer it up and have it on top of my jackets and it's gonna keep me really warm hello Chris it just came in you wanna say hi to the camera hello <laughs> he's playing like cheese me Say hi! Hi! My name is Crazy and all I want to do is just eat biscuits. Hi! Oh, Crazy. There you go. Now, in terms of jackets, I'm gonna get this jewels clothing jacket, which I really love. And it's the field coat I've been wearing it in pretty much for six months now in all the dog <laughs> it's only in all the dog walks I've been going. And I love it, it keeps me really warm. And then the next one would be this barber jacket. It's waterproof and windproof. So in case of a rain, you know, it's just gonna save the situation. It also has a hoodie. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna get in terms of jackets. Last but not least, the important things, footwear and bags. So I'm gonna get, get these, I think they are due. I got them three years ago from Debenhams and I, I haven't worn them much as you can tell but they're really comfy and I love them and very stylish and then my Sorel fits um, it's I'm actually looking forward to test drive them into the snow looking forward to wearing them and then my Radley bags I have two of them because I'm a Radley fan and this is the black one that pretty much you've seen in most of my Instagram stories and posts so I'm gonna wear this one for something more like going out for drinks and then I like having a backpack when I'm traveling because I can just have everything in there and not worry and this one has literally saved my life I have it for two years now and I've been cycling every day from my office in Old Aberdeen to where I live in West End of Aberdeen and I've been carrying from dog food to anything you can imagine, even soy of course and it hasn't torn, it's still like new so yeah, if I travel I can have my camera here and a bottle of water and anything else that I need and it's gonna be there for me that was today's video of what I'm gonna pack in Norway with me and why I'm going in Norway I hope you enjoyed it I'm just gonna have some soup now and some tea and then stay here with Crazy and maybe watch a movie I have lots of emails to answer. If you're a blogger, then you know that this is the most busy period in the blogging and blog sphere. But if you're not a blogger, then yeah, this is the most busy period and everyone wants to work with you on different projects on the run of the festive days and Christmas. So it's been quite hectic in my, as I like to say, not busy headquarters, but I mean my living room really. Um, yeah, so thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you're gonna follow my travels in Norway. Once again, thank you to the Upper Dean Airport for organizing that and Widero Airlines and Visit Bergen. I'm very grateful for people who support Nappies and I hope you're gonna support them too. So, until next time, see ya!